Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you to all of our drivers, the views and the comments, and to the first vlog of 2020. Today we're going to cut firewood without a chainsaw, miraculously. The most efficient, productive way to produce firewood out there. Uh, we're going to cheat. We're going to use our firewood processor behind us, over here. This should produce a quarter of wood in about 15 minutes, a lot faster than you guys using the chainsaw and the splitter and the broken back and being all sweaty by the end of the day. Um, we're going to take you guys along and show you kind of how we produce a quarter of wood. We'll deliver it to the customer uh, and we'll show you the whole process. So we have the deck loaded up right now with a series of mixed hardwoods. Um, there's a little bit of maple in here, looks like a little bit of birch right here. The most important thing when you're trying to season logs is you want to let them sit for about three to four years. You can see you're starting to get a little bit of discoloration on the outside, a little bit of fungus growth. The log is drying from the outside in, so all the moisture is coming out of the material. Um, we have them all set up here on the deck. We do have a fairly large sugar maple right here. Hopefully that opens up nice, doesn't give us a hard time to split. The oak you have to pay primarily uh, particular attention to because it does take a little bit longer to dry. It takes probably about three to four years to dry oak. So we do have a couple oak logs in here. Um, the most important thing when you're cutting firewood, it doesn't matter with a chainsaw or with a processor like we have here, is you want to cut it all the same length. You don't want long pieces, you don't want short pieces. Like you see on the ground here, these are the pieces that won't go in the machine. They're all different length and they, and they just won't fit in your stove. So that's how you want to set it up. You want all the big ends on one side and you just work your way down and cut them up. We do have a little bit of wood left. I'll put the tag and the link in the link below to how to season firewood and we'll take you guys along and start the machine up give you a couple different angles and comment below right now to see how long it takes us to produce one cord remember this has a little bit smaller material so it won't add up as quickly but I'd like to see your guys uh, estimate So right now we're just going to let the machine warm up a little bit. Uh, it's primarily, primarily hydraulic driven, so we want to let the hydraulic oil get warmed up. We don't want to run the machine cold. So we'll turn on the hydraulic warmer, the conveyor, just to get the system running a little bit. And then we'll set you guys in a couple different angles so you can see uh, what happens. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button. 